What's up guys, here's Claudio from Visual Model WordPress Teams. And in today's video, you're gonna keep learning how to use the Advanced Book Calendar WordPress plugin for free. So we can create reservations and booking forms for availability rooms into our WordPress website for free. Into the previous video, we did create a calendar and create a decision to assign for a calendar. So we can have a room set up with all the fields that the rooms need to have. And in today's video, we're going to learn how to display this booking form into our WordPress website page, sidebar or widget. After the booking, after the calendar creation, creation and decision creation, the price is set up, we're going to do we're gonna be displaying this calendar into a page. Go to page, add new, give this page some title, and into the plus button of Gutenberg Editor, you can up type search for booking. We have three elements for this plugin. The very first one is the booking form. The form that use Ajax so the user can book a room and the single calendar for the user can view into a calendar style the availab availability of the rooms and here is our calendar if you select all you can see the check-in, check-out, and the final price. But to book a room, you need to use the form into the bottom. You can apply it into columns. I'm gonna be doing this and editing this page to display some map and create a real page into a next video. If you click in the hotel, you can be directed to the page that you set to be the hotel page. Now, you can go to booking and it's gonna be opening a field with your contact information. Name, zip code, last name, city, email address, country, phone number, a message, and a street address. After that, as soon as you click into the book now button, you're gonna be receiving, if the user click on book now, you, as the site owner, gonna be receiving into your email and into the WordPress dashboard a new booking so you can accept or reject. And the user gonna be receiving an email as well into his or her inbox. This is the message that gonna appears. Now, if you go to the booking section into your WordPress website, you can see a new booking present. Now, let me show how to display this booking form as a widget into the footer. Let me just organize the footer here so we can have less elements. I'm gonna simply drag and drop the widgets into WordPress, dashboard, appearance, widgets. And according to the theme that you are using, the names of the footer columns may be different. So no worries and simply drag and drop elements so you can learn what is what. Now, we're gonna be using the availability form widget. That is the widget applied and created by Advanced Booking Calendar WordPress plugin. Drag it and drop into the footer column that you want to display it. You can change the widget title. For example, reservation. And here is our booking form into our footer as a widget. We also can apply it into the blog sidebar in exactly the same way. Let me go to the blog page. Let me just select one post. Here's our right sidebar of widgets. And I'm gonna be using the same widget into the sidebar availability form widget. Drag and drop right here. And here is our widget. Let me show you. If you go back to our WordPress dashboard after one user has made its booking, you go to Advanced Booking Calendar, Bookings, you can see the first booking made using this form with the name information, the address, the price you're going to pay, and you can 
confirm, reject, edit or see the custom message. If you click on confirm, you're gonna be have one room closed for this period, for this amount of time. And it is, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Feel free to use the comment section below in the case that you have any question. And don't forget to check out the visualmoto.com portfolio of amazing WordPress themes. And I see you later. All the best. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel for our latest video using this plugin and customizing its pages. And it is, I see you later. All the best.